In this video, I want to go through a couple of examples of how we multiply integers together. So first of all, 26 times 9. Now, you could do that via mental arithmetic uh, by doing 26 times 10, so 260, and then subtracting 26 from that, leaving you with 9 lots of 26. So you could do it that way. But I'm going to show you how to formally lay it out. So 26 times 9. So we write the larger number at the top, small at the bottom, making sure the units uh, and tens column, etc. line up. And put a times and then draw a line. So layout-wise, it looks very similar to addition and subtraction. So first of all, 9 times 6 is 54. So we put down the 4, carry the 5. We then do the 9 times the 2, which is 18, plus the 5 is 23. So we put down the 3, carry the 2. But there's nothing left to multiply the 9 by, so it would just be essentially be 9 times 0. And then we've got to add the 2, so the 2 can just drop straight down. So 26 times 9 is 234. OK. Right, let's take a look at another example. 312 times 16. 312 times 16. So first of all, we've got 6 times 2, which is 12. So put down the 2, carry the 1. 6 times 1 is 6, plus the 1 is 7. 6 times 3 is 18, put down the 8, carry the 1. 6 times nothing, plus the 1, is 1. OK, but we're not done because we still need to multiply this one by the 312 as well. However, the one that is in here is in the tens column. So essentially, it is 10 times 312. OK, now when we were multiplying by multiples of 10 or powers of 10 rather um, earlier on, I essentially just add a zero onto the end. Okay, that was one of the tricks, a trick way of seeing how you multiply an integer by 10. So in order to get this right and make sure everything lines up correctly, we put a zero into the next line. Because that now means I can do one times each of these without having to worry about that extra 10 that I'm multiplying by. So now I can do 1 times 2, 1 times 1, and 1 times 3. OK? And now I have my two numbers here. The two numbers that I get, I need to add together to get my final answer. 2 plus 0 is 2. 7 plus 2 is 9. 8 plus 1 is 9. 1 plus 3 is 4. So the answer is 4,900 and 92.